today try to understand how to find out the mean and mean deviation about mean the formula for mean is given by summation of fi xi divided by summation of fi similarly the formula for mean deviation about mean is fi di divided by summation of fi now suppose here we are having some values of xi that is a variable xi so these are some values similarly the corresponding frequencies are given over here now first here we will find out for the calculation of the mean we know that it is summation of fi xi divided by summation of fi so we will require the product of fi and xi so in this cell we are having this formula of a2 into b2 because a2 is this term and b2 is this term so fi xi will be given by the product of these two term similarly at this place also we are having the similar formula we have copied at all other places then this will give the summation of fi xi from this cell that is from c2 to c7 so that summation we can calculate so summation of all these terms will be this particular value and that is 119 similarly summation of fi will be from this cell up to this cell and that is given by this particular cell that is summation of b2 to b7 will be given by b8 that is nothing but 19 in this case so in this way we can calculate the mean by using these two values so summation of fi xi is given by the cell c8 c8 is nothing but this cell and summation of fi is given by this b8 that is this particular cell so c8 divided by b8 and that value is 6.2632 now we have to calculate the mean deviation about mean and the formula for mean deviation is summation of fi di divided by summation of fi where di is the absolute deviation of the given particular variable from its mean so here the values of the xi are this one so first value of xi is 1 and its deviation from the mean will be 1 minus this 6.2632 this value so and the absolute value we have to take or mod value we have to take so we will always get the positive value over here so in this case over here we have taken the formula or rather we have written the formula of absolute of a2 minus j6 so a2 is this term and j6 is this particular term that is nothing but the mean so 1 minus 6.2632 mod value will be absolute value will be 5.263 similarly at all the other places for example suppose we consider this will be a3 minus j6 a3 is 3 minus 6.26 similarly 4 minus the given particular value that is mean will be this particular value similarly we are having the formula for all the other cells now we will take into consideration the product of this frequency fi and the deviation di or absolute deviation di so fi di that product we have to find out so that is nothing but given by this cell so here the formula that we are having will be nothing but b2 that is this cell and d2 that is this particular value so it is 2 into 5.26 that will be around 10.53 and like that so this formula will be present it is copied at all the other places now for the calculation of the mean deviation about mean we required summation of fidi so this is the value of summation of fidi that is nothing but the cell e8 and divided by summation of fi that is summation of frequencies that is nothing but the cell that is this cell that is b8 so this is the value so e8 that is 71.79 divided by b8 that is 19 will be the deviation mean deviation about mean and that value is 3.7784 now similarly here we can choose some different values of the variable and corresponding frequencies so we are just taking some random values again over here and corresponding frequencies are say 5 and 2 and we'll get the required values of the mean 
as well as the mean deviation about mean. So in this way, we can calculate the mean and mean deviation about mean using Excel.